let's go and head and do format structure only uh, so that it will become a little bit easier the first thing I want to do is for the report title I want to make this different this report will be displaying the revenue the margin and quant quantity sold for various product lines check this if it's okay it will come up and you see there is an underline here I don't want it to be like that so what I'll do is I'll go ahead and click on underline you see how it was selected now it does not and now I want it to be bold because this is uh, the title I will make I will expand this title so that it will I will center it I'll align this basically and I will also uh, give it some background color for these table headers let me see if I'll select all I'll give the same background color I'll make the font black it's Arial 9 I'll make it 12 a little bit oh, let's keep it to 10 I don't want it to take a lot of space and I also want it to be center in both ways okay and let's go ahead select the whole table and I will give it a border for now there is no border so I'll give it a border the lines might need a little bit more space I'll give this table also a border okay looks like now it's good okay. you can select the align element and align them so this is I think this is okay for now And I will drag this table a little bit lower because I want to add two blank cells in here. Okay, this one, this one will be for the year selected. I want to display the year selected I want it to have a background color I want it to have I don't want this to be bold so fine like this you selected let me copy this and paste it and I'll make this state selected okay. here let me go ahead and do it like this align left okay now it's all aligned to left and now I'll add another blank field here so that will make this dynamic Once again, formatting. Font 12. I don't want this to be bold. And I want this to be a formula. So I'll enter equal. I want to use the user response. User response for year selected is okay. If I, if I don't know what 
what the name of the prompt is then we can go to the document summary the document like to validate it no for now let's keep it like that don't want to lose that information okay enter year and enter state is the name of the prompt we can enter that in here now in double quotes you will also require this as is okay now you will validate it and it will not show you the value it will later on okay now border. I don't want any border for this one so there's no border I will insert another blank element for this state I will enter the formula for this once again user response enter state yes enter here and enter see this is bold because I did not deselect the bold here and for the border no border and let's see how it looks now with data so now this is showing whatever uh, state and here we selected now we have formatted this report 